Hi, I'm Fraser. I'm a marketing consultant. I switched from Google Slides to Microsoft PowerPoint. For more reviews like this, please click below. The main problem that these products help me solve is simply the ability to present information in an understandable, simple and flexible format. The real choice that many people make between Google Slides and Microsoft PowerPoint is which ecosystem they're already in. Are they Google Docs people or are they Microsoft Office people? But I think one of the main things that stands out for me is that Microsoft PowerPoint is more used around the world as a bigger ecosystem. More people use it, it's a more standard format. So that's a big plus for Microsoft PowerPoint. The other thing is that it, you can do really good things that not many people know sometimes by using the PowerPoint canvas to easily make and save images. Google Slides is great for very quick and simple presentations. It's not got all the bells and whistles of Microsoft PowerPoint, but that might not be needed. And especially if you've got if the main uses for your internal team rather than external partners or clients, then Google Slides can be a great, simple product to have in your uh, software uh, tool set. I've been using Microsoft PowerPoint for much longer than Google Slides. So uh, if I remember right, there's a bit of a learning curve at the start of PowerPoint. Certainly Google Slides is a simpler um, tool, but also I think once you have used one of the tools, it's much easier to use the other. So as Google Slides, shall we say, modeled heavily from Microsoft PowerPoint when it was introduced, it was a pretty, pretty simple learning curve. The main considerations for this type of software are, uh, to, to reiterate, which uh, Office Suite do you tend to use most in your business? And which Office Suite type of um, Office Suite do your clients and customers use? That is a very important decision. The, then the, the other one is how advanced are you? Do you need all the bells and whistles of PowerPoint? Do you need the ability to do some sort of serious animations that maybe only 5% of people will ever use? Um, and then uh, finally, there, there is a cost issue as well because uh, Google Docs, certainly for home small business use, is pretty much free. And it's certainly got a free tier, whereas the Microsoft PowerPoint is part of the Office Suite and Windows, and that comes with a cost. So that's the other thing to think about.